topic for today is becoming a god in heaven now the interesting stuff about the oapc is that it gives the examples upon examples of a lot of angels in heaven where the creator tells humans and spirits how for you to become a god you don't just go to heaven and become a god right away some years back i did a video about educational system in heaven i did videos uh about who and what god is what is satan and when you continue to read the apps and you you get to see certain examples that explains how to become a god and there's two versions of god and then there's the the fake god which means that that god did not receive the mantu from the creator or did not receive the mantu from an interior god you see uh to become a god in a, in the lower heaven in this instance and of course in the interior they have you know how they choose the gods and stuff like that xyz just to be clear the creator do assign god okay to rule but the inspiration come from you know the italians right um so i was just reading the OAPC and i came across this wonderful 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 chapter by a goddess by the name of Sinta Amaj. and i was like hmm now this is something people will want to see now it you don't just die in our world and go to heaven and then next day you become a god so um so i'm gonna go to the book of simple and march chapter 9 verses 4 to 7 now i want you to listen to this god answered through his messenger saying greeting in the name of jehovah to Simpa Amaj, his daughter, chieftainess. That's interesting. The reigning God deputizes you, O oh goddess, to make the selection instead, to be crowned at the termination of dawn. And now, accordingly, Simpa Amaj sent forth our examiner to search for the highest, best, most land of all that have been raised up from the earth. You see that? capable of the godhead for 60 days our examiners were at work and in the evening of the 16th day they had completed the search and it fell upon Taholi, or shall i say tail of pihola whose compora birth had been five thousand years before now you see that so what this chapter four sorry what this verse 4 is saying in chapter 9 in the book of Simtar Marge is this angel while alive right died okay and took 5,000 years to be selected as a position to be selected to resume or assume the position of god now when we look at our world we have something similar to that right so you know i'm not going to mention my names and stuff like that um but when you really look at how the u.s presidential seat is selected they actually believe it or not choose who's going to be the next president and before that person become a president 
most apt you know become a senator once in a while in and you know previously in a state or must have uh, be a governor but you must have you know actually uh, rule or serve for a certain amount of years you know um so here's a, a an interesting spirit here you know uh, so I'm going to go to verse 5 because I, I really find this very interesting how Simta Marge selected this person, you know, to become the God. So I'm going to go to verse 5. Verse 5. Tail. Now, this is the angel's resume. Okay. Tail. A tiler of soil in copper. In other words, this you could clearly tell this was a farmer, or if it's not a farmer, but he was involved in agriculture, born in spirit, in using. I love the OFC. Look at this. Clearly explained. OFC is explaining and giving details, so there's no sugar coating. You know, you know. At the end of the book, at the end of this chapter, you're not trying to figure out what in the world is going on you know what's happening you know or i i don't understand i'm missing details you know so tell a tile of soy in copper burning spirit in Yuzon, 90 years so um this spirit spent 90 years before you know he died five years in Ezean. In other words, he spent five years as an Ezean in heaven. Okay. Now this is interesting. Then he spent thirty years in fire trees. In the nurseries, ninety years. Now, what's so amazing is this is in accord of the book of divinity. If you've not read it, the book of divinity talks about you know um educational system that angels in first resolution have to go through and then angels in second resolution educational system and this is equivalent this is amazing this is beautiful you need to read this you know you need to read this book of simta marge chapter four because i kid you not this is very interesting to read on uh, 90 years in the colleges, 180 years projector, 70 years surveyor, 65 years measurer, 200 years entered an interior Aravana. Now, that's a ship or uh, spaceship, okay? And traveled 700 years. Now, Wow. So this is equivalent of a pilot who travels from one country on another door. Now, you know, you have a pilot who will travel to France today, who will then from there go to London. On um, after London, or travel to Africa, say South Africa, from there we go to Benin Republic, and from Benin Republic, this pilot will travel um to Guinea, and then from Guinea, we'll go to Mexico, from Mexico, it will travel back to Greece, and from Greece, it will go to Italy. You know what I mean? So, this spirit spent, this is amazing, 700 years traveling in a ship, uh, aircraft now in heaven spacecraft ship you know flying ship whatever you want to call it you know 700 years and returned to the lower heavens of the earth and for 1200 years was a lord in six successions for each of the chief earth divisions was called by una vista goddess of Niyanga Atta to clear the roads of change Yaha B 
beyond Chinvat, where he labored 600 years, returned again to the earth and our heavens. He served as a captain and general for 400 years. Wow. Served as a marshal 700 years. Amazing. On the four different guards and lords. And the balance of the time traveled as messenger and swift messenger of the race in a thousand. He was 999. Wow. And he knew the world earth and capacity could read. Now, this is beautiful. I mean, I'm talking about this is amazing. Now, this year is amazing. Let me, I'm going to, I'm going to put a pen on that. You know, oh, actually, let me, let me, let, 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 let me put a, a nice blueprint here. This is amazing. Could read a billion voices at the same time can you see that look at this this is beautiful this is amazing this angel could read a billion voices at the same time and interpret interpret them and answer them now this must be a powerful angel i love this and had even created plateaus he knew the atmosphere heavens habitable and uninhabitable in sorry habitable and uninhabitable the roadways the oceans and the nebulous regions knew the ascending and descending ether knew the power in the different rings of the earth's vortices knew the sing bomb goom and its times and places I, I love this angel i mean look at this i can't wait for me to go to heaven and uh kind of like you know go through these phases just to become a god this is amazing the wonderful part is that he could read a billion voices at the same time and interpret them and answer them wow this is interesting this is a powerful angel and now this is what you need to become a god right and this is what it takes so i'm going to go to the next uh verse so yeah we have Uh, six Simtam has sent a delegation of one million angels to wait until and bring him before the throne at Kaoshibi, sending them in a private Otivan, that's a, a spacecraft now, and under the guardianship of a ship marshal with this commandment, verse 7, tale of Piola, greeting to you in the name of Jehovah, who commands your immediate presence at the throne in Kaoshibi, of all the honor. In this heaven, you stand false on the list. Now, let's pause for a minute. This is interesting. You see that? It says, You stand. See right there? It says, You stand forced on the list. This is interesting. What is it saying here? What this is saying is they have all the names it, it, it's no different how when you go to a job interview uh they they will uh so basically they will have about seven or eight people that they will interview and yet at the end of the day they'll present a list to you know the hiring manager so this is something similar and this they they're telling this angel tale that you stand first on the list and are appointed by our father to be the next succeeding God through his daughter, chieftainess of how it is sent. You shall sit on the throne in my place while I complete my labor in dawn. After which you shall be crowned Jehovah's God. Listen to this. 
you shall be crowned Jehovah is God of the earth and our heavens yeah this is amazing because um when you carefully 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 read this you clearly see that there are different intervals where God can rule so it's not just how the Christian Bible is saying God has been because when you read you know the Christian Bible it it not it appears it, it is to them it's one God that was ruling or was talking from the beginning according to them Genesis all the way to Revelation which is not true or actually present a different view saying there are multiple gods and they you know are ruled at multiple times you know so yeah it's an a, a, a angel who was once human in our world and now he's going to uh, rule heaven and our heavens so um sorry he's going to rule heart you know which is our world and then the heavens when they say heavens they're talking about first resurrection second resurrection heaven and then third heaven third heaven is where the angels female angels and male angels are waiting to ascend um or shall i say to travel or be drafted to etheria because we have a different heaven after third heaven now after the third resurrection that's etheria and uh nice enough or should i say fortunately the christian bible did not mention anything about the italian world so we are lost there when you continue reading the bible but yeah we have it uh ladies and gentlemen this is a perfect example how for you to become a god this character this angel profile it's amazing did all kind of stuff went through different processes you know um compared to the way how some people ascend to to become a god so or absolutely gives other examples of how they took the mantle like for example cyrus just declared himself a god bow declared himself a god i know Asaj did at one point i know did ahura did so there are multiple instances okay but um they, they did not they did not have that mantu you know the mantu was not given to them they took the mantu so a perfect example is uh how in africa um for example I'll, I'll use a particular country where i'm originally from so i'm originally from nigeria so how um the military will plan a coup okay the planning coup they take over the country so the a, a particular military leader becomes the president of nigeria that's a you know but the people did not vote him in they did not vote him in he he you could say a dictator so he just planned the coup take over the country and he's the president no different how they do it in heaven Osiris and all these other sort of false gods is fallen angels they said hey I'm not following the way of the creator no more the creator is void to me you know what I'm I'm taking lead now I'm taking charge and they come up with your own doctrine they look for someone who can understand what they say and they present and they take over Evelyn kingdoms they take over a kingdom no different now a bigger difference here is if you follow the creator way you wait your line you become a god eventually the good news about these ones are, is they get to rise to etheria the ones who are dictators these angels who are dictators who take it upon themselves to become a, a god without authority without being authorized or without being given that man to they at the end of the day get cast to hell okay and after hell you're supposed to lift all the people that you deceived one the people you've deceived you must lift them up so until the lowest member 
the lowest angel that you've deceived has been lifted up when i say lift up they've risen to the level where they will not go back to your old ways okay then would you now have the opportunity to rise you see you know brothers and sisters here is the symptom marriage choosing a a god i love this symptom marriage character this angel she's wonderful every time i read the book of symptom marriage i'm just amazed